Hello family members and friends. Uh, right now we are in uh, Sunny's town and from here uh, we are planning to go to Lakhuti uh, village and we will explore and come. So please be with me till the end of the video. We will go together and come. Thank you. Peace. We are halfway to Lakuti from uh, Sunny's. So let me just show you around. Uh, we can see Doyang from here. It might take half an hour or so to reach Doyang. Finally, we have reached the welcome gate of Lakudi village. So we will go and explore and see. So right now uh, we are in uh, Don Bosco High School Lakudi. So this is a view of the institution as you can see here. Yeah, having a break now. Nine. Class nine. Yeah. Okay, great. Do you have any section? No section, right? All right. Less in number. Oh. We are having a great time over here. Hello teachers! Uh, hi. How are you all? Fine! <laughs> the break is over! It's time to go to the classes! Oli na ida lang ang chang denang? Oli lang ang? Acha 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 This part will lead them to the field So they are repairing it Alam et sunga alam et sunga Hindi sa siya mga mga yan ako sa this is a ground constructed under Kelo India. It's nice. We are in the middle of the village. Shall we go this side? Yeah. Reach the helipad, and from here we will go this side, this way, and visit Amutza uh, Kotaus. Great. We are on top of Adipyung. Adipyung, no? Yeah. Okay. So here lies Ansang and Naga Patriot. Praise the Lord. Forgive my life to serve for the nation's cause. Kugnalim, Kotaus Yantan. Born on 25th August 1923 and died on 1st March 2010. who devoted his entire life for the cause of the Nagas. And he even gave warning. See, let me just read out for you. Warning. The survival of the Nagas depends upon their nationhood. If the Nagas had failed to uphold their ancestral sovereign nation, they would become a lost tribes and vanish in their disappearing nation. May God forbid it. This is a warning given by Amutsu Kotao, who was a great visionary Naga leader. I just called it here, Bench Lock. Yeah. I can be a bitch. I can be a bitch. My bed is a bit big. It's a bit difficult. Oh, there's no shed here. Here, here, here. Hey, 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 hey. Almost there, almost there. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, see, it's so beautiful. Let's go to Tilung. Now we have to go walking. Mm. With my guide. Almost there, almost there. You might have seen in my last video, I have already uploaded about this Tilung. So, this will be my second visit. See, this is a 
This is quite massive. That is also another one. And this is the one that I'm talking about. This is the Tilung. So let's go up. We'll take rest for some time. So calm and beautiful. Let's go up. But it's a little bit sunny up there. We have reached finally. We are in Tilung. We don't have anything special, just uh, real juice and why why? We're gonna enjoy this. <laughs> just this one. Yeah. <laughs> There's another one. Let's go and see whether we can go up. Oh. This looks beautiful. It looks like a bed. Hey. Yeah, we are on the other side. It's so peaceful. Very good spot for picnic. You should come here to Tilung for picnic. Next time I'll try to come with my friends if possible. While going it's very easy but returning while returning it's a little bit tiresome. Oh, my Harley is waiting for me. This is the Woro Emen or the bird's peak. In Lotha we call it Woro Emen. This one looks like a bird's peak. So this one. This is the one that I'm talking about. And this uh, peak, this one, it's uh, pointing towards the plain areas. It has a meaning. But I don't know uh, if anyone knows what it signifies. Can comment down below. This is a resting shed. We can see Bhakti Valley from here down the the whole area. This is Bhakti Valley. Peace be with you. In honor of all the missionaries of all ages.